Hello friends, uh, my name is Raza Masood. Today we will discuss about a topic value analysis or value engineering. Friend, this topic pertains to project management and uh, today we will see uh, with respect to project management, PMI or project management body of knowledge that what does it mean by uh, value analysis or uh, value engineering. Friend, uh, with respect to project management, value analysis or uh, generally it's called as value engineering these are the same uh, terminologies uh, value analysis or value engineering uh, friend this topic pertains to cost management and uh, today we will see this topic in detail and uh, uh, i will try my level best to explain you the concept of value analysis or value engineering in a very easy to understand manner uh, friend the purpose of making this video is that if any student who is studying project management in any university so um, I just want to explain the topic in a very easy to understand manner so that this video can be helpful for you if you are planning to give exam of project management in university or uh, you are planning to give exam of PMP uh, so this video can be helpful for you uh, friend this topic value analysis is important and you must have a knowledge about this topic because you must see this topic in exam so with respect to exam point of view this topic is important and around uh, around four to five questions you will see in exam if we talk about PMP exam that uh, which are uh, related to value analysis a uh, friend remember one thing that uh, uh, in the exam they will never ask you if we talk about PMP they will never ask you to calculate the value analysis they will give you scenarios uh, and you have to analyze if your concepts are clear you can analyze and give the answers accordingly so friend your knowledge your concept should be very clear about uh, value analysis or value engineering secondly if you are a professional project manager and working in any organization so uh, you again uh, because cost management is very important as a project manager you should be able to manage the cost so uh, your concept your implementation knowledge should be clear that how to uh, do the value analysis because as a project manager you should be able to manage the cost and uh, you should have a very good concept you should be able to manage the cost because if you if you complete the project within the cost you are a successful project manager and if you are not managing the cost and you overrun the cost uh, for your project so it means that your project is not in a good status so a uh, friend value analysis is very important and you should have a very good concept so that you can implement that concept in your uh, in your projects uh, to complete the project successfully and within the time and cost so you can be a successful project manager uh, friend I would request here first of all that please subscribe to my channel and click on the bell option as well so that my new videos can reach to you so let's start what is value analysis or value engineering friend just see this, this term value analysis or value engineering friend this topic is directly related to cost friend see First of all, uh, just remember one thing that if you want to become a su uh, successful project manager, you should be able to manage your cost and time as well and quality. These are very important factor. So right now we focus only uh, related to cost here. See friend, uh, because this topic is directly related to cost. See friend, remember one thing that uh, as a project manager, uh, you should have to able to complete your project within the cost for example if you are implementing a, a banking solution for example you are making you are uh, have to make a, a banking solution app uh, for fund transfers and uh, mobile top up etc so f remember one thing friend that if the cost is let's suppose uh, $2,000 for example the cost is $2,000 and you have to complete the project in four months so remember one thing friend that if you are a good project manager you must have to complete the project within that cost if that cost if you uh, complete the project at some early stage or within the cost you have you are a successful project manager or if you are not complete the project on the time or you over on the cost like uh, instead of 2000 cost uh, you have spent it 
let's suppose five thousand dollar or four thousand dollars so it means definitely that uh, your project is overrun for cost and remember one thing friend uh, honestly saying that as a project manager you have to see the consequences of that so as a project manager you must have to uh, you must have to fulfill the quality and you also must have to complete the project within time and cost this is very 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 important so now if you talk about value engineering uh, generally value engineering is called as ve as well so value engineering or value analysis is an organized attempt to optimize the overall value of the project in project management uh, management endeavors often creative uh, strategies will be employed in an attempt to achieve the lowest life cycle cost available for the project this means the project manager and those working on the project at hand must consider all co costs associated with this project from the initial design of the project or service through the uh, its eventual disposal see friend here uh, it means basically uh, this was only a uh, definition let me explain to you for example you are implementing an um, uh, an e-commerce solution so you have to do the value analysis here value analysis means that uh, you must have to consider the options uh, which you can use to uh, minimize your cost for example for example uh, if you see uh, for example you are implementing an e-commerce solution so uh, you there are many options are available for example you can do the uh, development of e-commerce solution from scratch from your own software developers or you can purchase the some ready-made uh, e-commerce solutions available and customize it as per the uh, as per the need of customer so you must have to do the value analysis that what are the possible solution uh, to uh, so that you can achieve the minimized cost and remember one thing that whenever we talk about value analysis it doesn't mean that you are only talking about the development of software this is not the case it talks about the overall life cycle of a cost law of life cycle means that project initiation development testing production deployment then uh, the uh, maintenance uh, then the operational cost then the maintenance cost and then the disposal of, of the uh, project so you we are talking about the overall life cycle of the project not only about any particular phase of a project so friend uh, similarly you can also see that whenever we talk about for example production deployment you must have to see that either there is a case that, that you can deploy the production uh, patch on your own server or some other uh, other servers remote servers available or and the premises of the uh, customer so you have to consider all these factor and you have to analyze that how you can achieve the minimized cost okay value analysis means friend you must have to see the option alternate ways through which you can achieve the minimize minimum cost okay this is called as value analysis or value engineering see they, uh, they they must then consider any cost saving alternative to be employed at any given phase of the project so friend this is called the value analysis in which you consider each phase of a project overall life cycle of a cost remember one thing that we are not talking only about the development of a project we are talking about the whole life cycle of a project life cycle means the project initiation development testing uh, testing production deployment uh, operational work uh, maintenance and then they dispose of so we are talking about all these phases and in all these phases you must have to consider that how you can achieve the minimum cost and uh, what are the alternate ways through which you can achieve the minimum cost you must have to consider all these options so that you can uh, you, you can achieve the minimum cost remember one thing that minimum cost mean doesn't means that you compromise on the quality it doesn't mean you will not compromise on the quality you will uh, try to achieve the uh, minimum cost but by fulfilling the quality you will never ever compromise on quality of work uh, on the name of uh, minimizing the cost remember one thing it doesn't mean value analysis mean doesn't mean that you will compromise on the quality Com you will never compromise on the quality however you will try to find the uh, cost effective solution some of the examples for uh, value analysis are some methods used in value engineering 
include reducing production time, reducing expenses, increasing earnings, expanding market share, using existing resources more efficiently, and improving product quality. Friend, that means the for value analysis, some very, very important example of value analysis means that you can consider your resources, that how you can use your resources more efficiently so that you can achieve the uh, more work and with less cost. So, uh, or you can uh, similarly you can see that how you can achieve your uh, different phases of work so that it can uh, you can achieve the uh, less cost of work. Again, remember, friend, one thing that uh, whatever phase of you talking about, uh, remember one thing you must have to finalize, you must have to find out the cost effective solutions for your project. However, however, remember one thing that it doesn't doesn't mean that you compromise on the quality of work. The quality will not compromise. However, you will try to find out cost effective solution or you will try to find out the some alternate ways through which you can minimize the cost and your scope will be same. There will be no change in the scope. Scope will uh, always be same. There will be no change in the scope. There will be no uh, change in the quality. However, you will try to find out some solutions which are cost effective and you can find out the uh, solutions which are cost effective and mini with minimum cost so that's it that's, uh, that's all from uh, so my side friend i hope you like this video if you like please share it with your friends and colleagues and thank you thanks a lot for your time and that's all from my side